Namaste. It's not low battery yet. It's been sitting here for a couple of days. Well, I've been contemplating. You know, I love to contemplate. Uh, contemplation and contemplating. Anyway, contemplating uh, one of my favorite examples, if it's true, of instinct-driven uh, behavior largely through feeling. Uh, the example being the high price of waterfront property, especially if it's raised up just a little so you have a broad view. You walk into this place and, as always, the threat and danger detecting systems are functioning. If there is no immediate threat and no, uh, let's say, unhandled danger, the danger detector has to decide, as it were, whether the resources, internal and external available, are adequate to neutralize any of the dangers foreseen. Like, uh, if you're at a cliff edge, <laughs> and you know it, you're not going to step off into thin air. So, as long as you're wide awake enough that you won't step, up, step off the cliff, that one's handled. And it's nice if there's a, a place to hide, more than nice, place to hide, uh, long view uh, along the uh, edges or edge of the water source. Fresh air, fresh water. Now. Is it really fresh? You haven't tasted it yet. But you feel already like this is it. This is a good place. Because at that level, water is water. You ain't never had ocean water yet, being a land animal and uh, highly attuned to somehow finding enough water, which was always fresh. So water is water, and what it looks like is beautiful, and what it sounds like is lovely, uh, and what it feels like and tastes like, well, <laughs> not if it's salt water, but uh, that's secondary, that's just another level. So anyway, waterfront property with a wide view. Prima, <laughs> low battery. <laughs>